Jazz music's presence in Toledo goes back as far as one can remember. But it's not about the past here at Lucille's Jazz Lounge. It's about the enrichment this genre brings to our lives now and for years to come. So Lucille's welcomes you to take a seat and relax into the soothing, melodic, and timeless sounds of jazz music. I knew immediately that jazz needed to be here. I grew up going to Rusty's, which was over on Tedro Drive, you know, mm -hmm. four nights a week. And I really missed that feeling of having live jazz and, you know, the local musicians and magicians doing their things on the stage. Magicians? And, yeah, magicians. Okay. Yeah, and then, so they, they bring about magic for you? Absolutely. Yeah. It's, okay. Particularly in jazz when, you know, so much of it is, you know, just on the fly and it's not so scripted. And those guys, yeah, it's very, very improv and impromptu guys and gals who really create beautiful music and have great stage presences, I miss that. And having that on the stage here in an intimate room, you know, I knew needed to be here at Toll House. There's this 10 year or more gap where there was no dedicated jazz lounge. And mm -hmm. so Lucille's, what's special about Lucille's, this is a dedicated jazz room. So as far as we'll stretch, it's about blues. Yes, in and so yeah. we'll do jazz. Jazz, jazz, and blues. Yeah. <laughs> and so that's a that's about the breadth of yeah. musical genre that you're going to get in Lucille's. We wanted to embed the building with local talent, but we've had acts from Ann Arbor, Detroit, and mostly Toledo. But we will continue to build um, a reputation for bringing in acts from national acts and maybe international acts that uh, have a great show and a great appeal. And you welcome people like um, beginning musicians as well who are just starting out in the whole jazz world. Probably our youngest artist so far has been Olivia Van Gore. She's, you know, a rising talent, you know. Yeah. She, one day she'll be like the Ramona Collins, is a, you know, and the Kim Buellers. But today she's building an audience and, you know, so she had a sold out show here. It's a beautiful show, one of, you know, our best rated shows so far. Thank you. Are you trying to get a newer audience into your lounge and introduce them and get them really immersed in jazz? That's 100% correct. You yeah. know, I grew up a musician, yeah. but I didn't appreciate jazz until a friend of mine took me to Rusty's when right. I was 19 and 20 years old. Yeah. And so we do allow minors in, so you have to be okay. with an adult party, obviously. Uh -huh. And the intent there is to not only give, you know, young people a place to hang out with their parents, but also to introduce them to this beautiful form of music and to be able to do it in a moment like now where people are just starting to get comfortable going back out and people are craving live performances and right. craving community. Um, it's really special to me to be a part of, you know, to be a small brick in the, you know, building of Toledo's local jazz history. But if we can build a place that, number one, young people will get, begin to appreciate this music. Um, number two, we can honor the tradition of local jazz. And number three, we can build longevity. That's really what's important to us. I'm Emily, and this is Toledo Now.